Hello friends, welcome to Input Output Canvas. So today we will discuss about other coding questions from Tech Mahindra. So this question was came in the recent coding test in Tech Mahindra. So friends, today we will discuss the questions and then we will solve it. So here is the question. Write a program to calculate the total will tax amount for a list of willing amounts first as an array of long integers. Up to the amount 1000, there is no tax applicable. Subsequently, a flat tax of 10% is applicable for the remaining amount as per the tax rate. So there is also a note that all the calculations and results should be integer based and ignoring the fractions. Here in the input 1, there is 5 which is the number of elements into the array. So here is the input 2, these are the wheels. So here in the questions you can see that up to the amount 1000, there is no tax applicable. So for the first amount, which is 1000, so you don't have to pay any tax for this will. But in the next line, it is said that subsequently a flat tax of 10% is applicable for the remaining amount as per the tax rate. So for the remaining amount, 10% tax will be applicable subsequently. So for the will amount 1000, there will be no tax. But for the amount 2000, for the amount 2000, 10% tax will be applicable. So 10% of 2000 minus 1000. So which is 1000 by 10, which is 100. And for similarly for 3000, the tax will be 10% of 3000 minus 1000 equals to 2000 by 10 which is equals to 200 and similarly for 4000 the tax will be 300 and for 5000 the tax will be 400 and the total tax will be 1000 so hope you friends understand these questions now we'll solve it first we'll write the basic format of the c++ as include io stream using namespace standard in the main and inside this main function we'll write an integer n which is 5 this is the size of the array then we'll write the array uh, array name is a and inside this there will be 1000 2000 3000 4000 and 5000 so now we'll write a follow to iterate this area for int i equals to zero i less than n i plus plus and inside this we'll calculate the tax and we'll store it into the result so result equals to result plus so we'll subtract 1000 from each element of this array and multiply it with 10 percent so for that we'll write here a of i minus 1000 and we'll multiply it by 10 percent so how to write 10 percent so 10 by 100 in by 100 which is 0 0.1 so 0 0.1 this is the tax amount which is 10 by 100 and we have not declared an initial as this result variable so int result equals to 0 and finally we'll output it okay so let's run the code okay there is a error in line number 11 okay in line number 11 you can see in the line number 10 there is a semicolon run it again okay this is our expected output 1000 so friends hope you understand these questions and in the tech mahindra coding test all the coding questions were very easy to so practice it and prepare for the upcoming tech mahindra exams and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so friends thank you for watching this video